The kids start really early, but I got my coffee. Welcome back, family travelers. So happy we're here. Today, we're taking you on a culinary treat. We're camping on a campfire all day. It's gonna be great. And now the kid is getting into the camera, of course. You can't even do it. You can't do anything without watching them. Starting with coffee. You have to start your day. You might notice that we just have like our traditional at-home coffee maker. We don't have a camp one because, well, we don't camp. So we just <laughs> brought a bunch of crap from home. So we'll link to below all of the stuff that we used. Uh, actually, that one's pretty nice. It makes a pot of coffee in like 30 seconds. Anyway, I digress. This isn't about coffee. We're gonna take you through breakfast, lunch, dinner, and dessert, all on the campfire. We're gonna see how that goes because the kids are everywhere and it's really, really hard to like, you know, focus on anything. Uh, but we're gonna let you know how it goes and... That's vital! Where? Capture it. Where? Right now! <laughs> what did I say? Anyway, I need more coffee. So let's get this day started. All right, we're starting with breakfast. Now, I think the plan is to do like some pancakes, sausage, eggs over the fire, or some combination. So let's get cooking and let's see what we can whip up for breakfast. Are we getting our wood for our campfire? Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. Are you gonna put on this one? Yep, sure. Getting us all ready for cooking breakfast? Well, yeah. Time to whip up some pancakes. You ready? <laughs> Step one down. Let's add some water to these guys. Looks about right. Sometimes you just gotta use what you have and what we have is uh, paper bowls, a plastic fork, some distilled water, and no measuring devices. That one is a little off. Breakfast is served. What do you think? Um, good. It's good? Yeah. Are you just saying that or is it really good? Very good. It's really good? Mm -hmm. Alright, good to hear it. Breakfast is served. Oh, yeah. Ooh, taste test time. Uh, what? It's time for digging for bath. You got something, Lovey? Mm -hmm. Let me see it. Can you put it here? What is it? It's a caterpillar. You got one. It's All your hard work paid off. After a tasty breakfast and a nice cool dip in the lake, socially distant, we are now having lunch. So what we're having is something that we have at home, but it's going to taste extra good because it's over campfire. It's a non-pizza. So let's go assemble our pizzas and we'll see how that tastes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have to do it like this. That's how you have to do it? Right? Yeah. Good work. Mm -hmm. And you even tasted the product. Pepperoni pizza. Pepperoni pizza. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going on a bear hunt. I'm not scared. Now? Now we just need cheese. We are living in a Naan pizza. Naan's an Indian bread you can get at your grocery store. It's just like a, it's like a pita, but it's Indian. Great pizza crust and a super quick meal. One of the musts when you come camping is to make little sandwiches with pie filling in them. Is there a word for that? Uh, pies. Pies. Camper pies? Camper pies. If there's not, we've made it up. We're doing dessert before dinner tonight because why not? 
And so we're gonna make that. We'll show you the process. Uh, key pro tip here, which we're not pros, but you know, something that we just know, is to preheat the little sandwich makers before you put all the fillings in. Adds a little something. So we're gonna make those, and then we're gonna have dinner. For dinner, we're making some brats, chicken, fried potatoes. So we got like a whole feast going on here. Come along. Holy God, my face is melting. It's hot. Yeah. Super hot. Load that with butter. Bread. Any fruit <laughs> topping will work. They gotta go with apple. What is that? Make an apple pie for you. Uh, you, you think we need one more apple? Mm, you think we need one more? Mm, okay, let's do one more. Boom. Now we're gonna close it up. Yeah, look at that. I'm gonna smush her in. Let's, Let's get that somewhere good How long and hot. Have you not had that chew? Nana dropped the apple pie. What do you have to say for yourself, Nana? I'm totally sorry. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Look at that. That is a solid campfire pie. How is it, honey? Good. We have to do so. This thing keeps like falling off. We are not on our game right now. Like this is just, like look at this. All right, we're good. Crushed it. This is an amateur hour. And the last hour has been a shit show. Yeah. Cooked dinner around a hot fire and the kids are running laps around the car. Nana's dropping sandwiches. You dropped a sandwich. The disappointment in a four-year-old's face is her treat. The best part is, though, we made a second one and she took exactly half of a bite. Yes. Livy. <laughs> Everett, you need a bath, little man. Okay, let's try to get everyone all in one spot and then we'll maybe eat. No more monkeys and none back. This is Olivia's little bouncy play area. Oh, that was graceful. Dog water. This is tedious to do. With. She's literally cutting blueberries in half with plastic fork. We have a knife. Well, I already started. We have a knife. I'm just gonna finish the job now because, you know, now I'm determined. So the kids are having shredded hot dogs, all beef. By the way, Brittany's just made that discovery. And we made the switch and we're not looking back. Game changer. She always used to like save a quarter a pack by getting the, the mix. I don't think she realized that there was all beef. No, I, I didn't know I there know was the a story difference. Is. I didn't realize there was a difference, no. but um, now I do. Now we're going to get them every time because it's life changing. Here it is, the last one. Ready for this? Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Crushed it. Wow, well done. Okay. 20 minutes later, dinner is served. So we're gonna go ahead and eat our dinner, and then it's probably gonna be dark, so. Yeah, it's about to hit. Yeah, I don't know if we'll get to show s'more making because, you know. We'll try. We'll see what we can do, but no promises. We lied when we said we weren't gonna get to marshmallows. Dinner went a lot faster, it's great. The kids are like, they're hungry after all this energy. Anyway, s'mores with these things. Focus, mister. It decided it didn't want, there it is. I don't even know what these things are called, but you roast the mallow and you put them on this instead of having graham crackers and the chocolate. It's so much nicer and so much easier. And then for the adults, marshmallows dipped in Baileys. It's gonna be a good night. Look at this. 
Now doesn't that look magical? It's a cool looking s'more, isn't it? Oh, because um, it's um a cookie. It's not a s'more, it's a cookie. Well, yeah, but a, a s'more cookie. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hopefully you enjoyed our culinary tour of Camping. Camping cuisine. Um, it's I think been we delightful. had some really like some hits in there, right? One of these days we'll get back to not having to cook for ourselves when we're on vacation. Thanks for joining us. Here comes Everett. Hi Everett. They're running laps Hi, Everett. right now. So anyway, make sure you subscribe. Follow us on social. You want to come stuff. here? Come here, buddy. Hey. He is <coughs> filthy. Oh my gosh. He needs a, a serious cleaning. Come here, buddy. Come here. Ouch. Never mind, he ran away. Okay, yeah, he decided, no thanks. Right? Okay, bye. I mean, he just crushed all those blueberries in about 10 seconds. <laughs> you can never go wrong when you stick to the classics. Cheers.